Hello there. Thanks for clicking. This is a tub of earth. I'm going to put some crickets in. I know some of you don't like crickets. I don't like crickets. They keep me up at night. There's some more crickets. Look at them. Just crickets. A lot of dead crickets. Dozens. Dead crickets. Fry them. Use them as a side. I know a lot of people like crickets. To eat. Let me fast forward. See if they do anything exciting. Okay, this is a banana. If you hadn't figured that out, I'm going to try and feed them. All that time it took me to peel this banana. They didn't even touch it. Crickets. Put a bit of apple down. They seem to prefer that. Maybe more juicy for the little buggers. Think they were looking for a juice drink here. Never really taken the time to understand crickets, but as with everything, they have a place on the cleanup crew. Why do crickets exist? Well, crickets, like all organisms, exist because they have undergone millions of years of evolution. Over time, through natural selection, crickets have adapted to their environments, fulfilling specific ecological roles as a food source, as a decomposer, pollinator, soil aeration and bioindicators, even as food for humans. God, that was so exciting. Did you fall asleep? Are you still watching this video? Well, if you are, there's close-ups coming. No interest now in this apple. We did notice quite a few died after giving them the last apple. Came to realise there are chemicals on the apples that probably killed some, so organic only. These crickets don't chirp, thankfully. That would drive us nuts, seriously. Crickets chirping are males try and get the attention of the female. By, yes, you guessed it, being loud, just like humans, really. No, that's not a male, female. That is called a ovipositor. They use that to lay their eggs. Males get mounted by the females. This is our Bronson, the praying mantis, or more accurately, our nymph E just molted. That is, he shed his exoskeleton and he is hungry. 